back to another video. Today I'll be showing you how to tell if your eggs are fresh. Sorry, I haven't been uh, posting lately. Um, I haven't been feeling well. Um, special thanks to Miss Jill for giving me the idea. Let's get into it. All right, guys, we're at the table now. Um, so what you're gonna need is cold water in a clear container so you can see it. And of course, eggs! The most important part! So, I love it look like I got it here. But maybe with a clap we could get it all here. One, two. Whoa, guys, look, it's all here now. We got the cold water in a clear container and eggs. I don't know if you can see. We got it. Um, let's roll up our sleeves so then we can get started. I don't know if I really do, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Now there are three types. What can happen to your egg? Just like this. Let's put it in there. The easiest, the most simple way to know that your egg is good. It will float straightly on the bottom. It will not tip up like this. Or it will not float. It will go straight on the bottom. Um, the other way will be when they're standing up. Like that. And then floating. Let's grab a few more eggs to see. Okay, let's try this one. And that's... I don't know what the... Yeah, that one's not on the ground even. This one is a floating egg. That means this one is bad. There's two things you can do with your eggs. If they're bad, you can what? Throw them in the trash and never see them again. Two, you could uh, put it, let them sit in vinegar, I think. I'll do a video of that one sometime where you could get rid of the entire shell and then all that will be left is the exoskeleton, the little part. Now I don't know, I don't know what it is, but it's it's soft, it can bounce. I do not recommend dead bouncing it on the floor with all your force. That is a very <laughs> bad decision. Now I tested one. that one. Let's grab another one. Come on, it's stuck in the egg carton. There we go. I'm gonna make sure these don't fall out. And that one rolled there. Slow motion replay. There. So now that we got that one, that's in there just moving around like a normal egg. Now this is not recommended for any eggs that you're gonna have, like shakes that like Hens that do not shit. This is not the way to check if they have chicks in them. You're gonna use a flashlight. Once I get a broody hen, um, I will show you how to do that. Check them. But right now, this egg's perfectly fine. Then we got this very tiny egg. Yes, yeah, very tiny egg. Let's see what this one will do. What? That one hit the ground and came straight back up. That was quick. Ah, uh, yes, this one is a floater. Mr. Floater. And now we know this one is bad. Like I said, there's all types. When they like float straight down like that, they're good. Up like that a little bit, they're okay. But you should eat them soon. And the float, bad. So get this one. Let's grab, uh, let's do like four more, and then we'll be done. There's another A. Drop that one in, bounces off the ground, comes back up, and then goes back down. This one is fine as well by the looks of it. Yeah, this one's good egg. I don't know why I like the do that. Uh, let's grab this other egg. Let's see. Oh, there's a... What are you doing, Mr. Egg? The egg goes down, hits the ground, comes back up, goes back down, comes back up, it goes back down, 
This one is on the ground, like I wanted to show you. It's on the ground, but it's sticking up. That's one of those eggs that you could either get rid of. That would be kind of more recommended. Or you could eat it. It's okay. Up to you. Next, let's grab this Americana egg. Drop that one. That one didn't even go down. That's when you know they're really bad. I guess that's four ways. If you just put them in there, they don't even go down at all. Like the little one. Here's the here's the little one. That went down and back up. See? This one, you just put it in the water. Okay, I guess I I guess I guess just putting yeah. I guess it's really the same. Grab those. Then we'll grab one last egg. Put that in there. And that one's fine. And now I'm gonna grab the ransom of them that were good. Here's the one of them. There's two of them. Now you do not have to do one of a time like me. You could just put multiple in there like that. I'm just showing you all the good ones. Next, I'm gonna take these out and show you the bad ones that we have. Ah! And I don't know what happened. I just put it in the egg carton and then water splashed straight into my eye. <laughs> I like it. And uh, now the grants some that were bad. That one, that one. Yeah, that one. That one floats. Here's another one. That one was up. That one was the one that would kind of stick up. And then here's that one. <laughs> that would float. And then the other one. So we had three floaters. One that was kind of bad, kind of not, I guess. You could, you could throw it away or eat it, but you're going to have to eat it like in a day or two. Or you could do... Or you could just put all the eggs in there. That you have, put them all in, done. I don't know, you know what I was saying for a second. Um, we got all of that. Now we could put these back. Now that these are all there. And that's how to, and that's today's video of how to check if your eggs are good or bad or fresh. I need to be fresh. Now, to tell if your eggs are fresh, remember to leave a thumbs up, uh, share, comment, and ring the notification bell so you never miss another video. And now, also, I'm not forgetting, the chicken of the day.